Hi. So today we do, we are going to discuss about the extended transaction available in the access to point of service. What is extended transaction? Apart from sale transaction, there are different type of transaction available in the access to point of service. We can perform at a post machine. As part of as part of retail application, there are different type of extended transaction available in the access store system. So what are the different transaction available in the access store post as a part of extended transaction system. The very first is a send sell transaction. The next one is a layaway transaction. The third one is a special order transaction. The fourth one is a work order transaction. Another is a warranty. The next one is a pre-sale. And the next one is a whole transaction. And if access store system is integrated with the Oracle retail order broker application, then another transaction available in the access store system is a order transaction. So, so where we can find this option? In the sell screen option, there is a button available where you uh, will be extended transaction once we are clicking that one then we will be able to see all the extended transactions supported in that particular retail environment so as you can see on my screen you uh, there are order send sale layaway special order work order warranty pre-sale and whole transaction available in my current system so once we are clicking on that one, then these uh, option will be, uh, these option are going to show by the system. So let's discuss about a uh, sense, uh, brief discussion, what are the sense, what is the layaway, what is the special order, what is the work order, and uh, what is the warranty, what is the pre-sale, what is the whole transaction. Let's discuss, uh, let's, Discuss in the brief. The send sale transaction is nothing. If the uh, item must be shipped to a customer a specific offsite location after it is purchased. Item must be paid in full before it is purchased. Item is available in the store at the time of purchase. Sense and transactions are generally used in case of direct shipment of a purchase item to a customer address and shipment of a gift item. So for the understanding purpose, you can keep sense of transaction is nothing. Just it's a kind of home delivery. So if a customer has purchased few items on your store and they want it should be delivered to their address then we are going to perform a send sell transaction. What is the layaway transaction? So layaway transaction is nothing. Customer in, a, uh, in this type of transaction, customer is available with an easy option to pay the entire cost of an item in desired number of periodic installments. So what the store, once we are performing the layaway transaction, a store reserves the item for the customer until the customer makes full payment. When the balance due is paid, the customer receives the items. System configuration are available to mark such transaction as a sale either during the setup or during the final pickup. 
So this is the layaway transaction. In simple, what we can say, layaway transaction is nothing. Just only if customer wants a kind of EMI option to pay their transaction cost, then we are going to perform a layaway transaction. The next one is a special order transaction. So a special order transaction is nothing. Suppose customer has trying to buy that item and that item quantity is not available in the store inventory. And then we are going to make a purchase. Then we will go and we will perform a special order transaction then only we will be able to sell that particular item that's inventory is not available in our store so it means soh value is less than what the customer is required so what's happening the special order transaction maybe we need to ship to the customer or, or maybe the customer can pick up the item at the store It's a kind of a special order transaction. In the sort, we can say if the inventory is not available and still the customer wants to purchase that item, then we are going to make a special order transaction. Work order transaction. Work order transaction is nothing. So suppose you might have visited the few fashion retailer and you might have bought some jeans and that size is not fitting, especially the length, then you are ordering i want to do the alteration for that item then what the retailer and associate will do they will go and they will perform a work order transaction for that item and once uh, there could be uh, some charges associated to the particular order for particular service or it may be the free also so that's a kind of give you the work order transaction the next one is a warranty a warranty nothing warranty service plan is promise made by the manufacturer or seller to support a product after its purchase so what the access store is supporting, you can configure the warranties items in the system. And once you are selling few items and you want to sell that warranty, then associate is going to perform a warranty transaction, extended transaction. Then he will be able to provide the warranty service. The next one is a pre-sale transaction. So what is a pre-sale transaction? In this type of extended transaction, what's happening? So suppose you might have done, so the particular item is available on sale to the particular date only. So we might have visited the Amazon, Flipkart, where we have seen, so on this particular day, we are going to make a, uh, available this item for the selling so if any customer wants to order that item before that available date means the inventory and available item availability of that item for sale and that particular store is less than that available date then we are going to make a pre-sale transaction and customer will be able to buy that item So there are few requirements are available in the pre-sale transaction we need to perform. Customer must be linked to the transaction means if customer is not associated with transaction, you are not, we won't be able to perform the pre-sale transaction. You need to pay full at the time of setup only. So only item on file can be added and you need to pick up all the item at the same time. The partially pickups are not allowed. The next is a whole transaction. So, so what's uh, in the whole transaction, what's happening? 
customer will purchase the merchandise but would like to store the whole items for a short period of time at later point of time customer can return the complete purchase or pick up of the reserved items customer association is must with the transaction with the whole transaction the next is order transaction as i told you so order if you uh, the access to system is integrated to work with the Oracle retail order broker application, then we are going to perform the order. So if uh, we can set up the order, if item is not available in the store inventory, then we will making the purchase. So this, uh, this, this item could be available in any other store within the system. So, or maybe in the warehouse. So we will place that one order and then the retail broker or the broker system will tell which a store, which warehouse is having a, that particular inventory. And we will be able to create this extended transaction. Means finally, we will be able to make the sell. So there are different options available for the within the order system. That is a pick up other store. So means the inventory is available in the other store. And where you will go, the customer can go and pick up that uh, uh, items. The customer delivery, we can make this uh, order to the customer home address also. And in this particular pick up this store also, we will be able to make that one. The another extended transaction is post white transaction. The one, what is the post white transaction? It can be performed on the same day on which the transaction was performed. Can be performed on a different register as well, means associate have done some transaction on register one and we we can do the post by transaction on that other register as well. Feature is available on the journal in back office, transaction status change from sale to white. So it's nothing, just we are canceling earlier transaction, what we have done as a sale transaction, we are making that transaction as a white. So this was the this was the extended transaction available in the access store system. If you want to learn, then you can contact us here and provide the feedback. Thank you so much for watching this video.